I bought the most expensive cookies money can buy. Let's try them and rate them 1 through 10. These cookies were $155 and you get 12 of them. It's a company based out in LA and they shipped the cookies directly to my house in two days. The customer service was fire. They emailed me like 12 times. They was really hyping it up. Like these are the most exclusive cookies you gonna possibly get. I'm so happy you bought them. Thank you for buying them. Tell people on Instagram that they don't cost too much. Well, we about to find out. <laughs> yeah, I'm so excited though. I'm a sucker for packaging. This is beautiful. Oh. This is a special Thanksgiving box, so it only comes with four flavors, but you get three each, so you get 12 cookies all together. These bags are not resealable. That's terrible. That's crazy. I'm getting a Ziploc bag. I'm from around away. I'm leaving here with something. The floor is lava. It's a lava cake cookie. Oh my God, look at that. Bro. Wait, it just shocked me. What is that? That's the best sweet I've ever had in my goddamn life. I didn't say cookie, I said sweet. 10 out of 10. I hate to do that on the first one. S'mores can't fire. 10 seconds in a microwave later. Oh my God, it's like falling apart. Oh, what? <laughs> I'm not a huge fan of s'mores flavored things, but that's done beautifully. Nine out of 10. Stifler's mom is American Pie. My wife just told me it's from the movie American Pie. I didn't know that. Straight out the microwave. This is probably the softest one. It's literally falling apart. I can't even pull it. What the f That's more like an apple cinnamon oatmeal cookie than it is apple pie. But nonetheless, that is delicious. 9.8 out of 10. Basic white girl pumpkin spice latte flavor. Oh, it's filled with something. Mm-mm. I don't like that. I just read the package and that's a cappuccino cream cheese with a pumpkin dough. I don't like that. That's like a three. It's like a two out of 10. I will attempt to justify why that's $150. The pros. The package does say that you can freeze them if you don't eat them all. And you can thaw them out on the counter and heat them up and they taste brand new. You can buy those for a wedding or like a little dinner party and you impress everybody. They delicious. Most of them, except for the last one. It's exclusive flavoring, which means they like drop limited. So you never know if you're going to get them or not. And everybody want to feel exclusive. Cons. It's $150 for a box of cookies. You're going to eat them and then you're going to realize you spent $150. To some of your friends, you might come off as a douchebag that just spent $150 on cookies. Did I successfully convince you that that's worth $150? I don't know. That's up to you. If it's up to me, I say $100. $85 with the EBT card. If I had to buy it again, $90 at the most. 